and the novel is called Understanding Stanley. Stanley is 58 and he's on a two week coach holiday visiting the historical sites of England. And this is early in the novel, it's in fact the first night. And uh, Stanley has been sitting listening to an induction lecture. Stanley concluded that Dr. Hutchinson, the well-known and local historian, had a certain Margaret Rutherford quality about her. <laughs> Introdu introduced to the group by Abigail, she was soon in full flow. The gathering listened, nodded and smiled in all the right places, and when she had finished gave her a polite, if short, round of applause. She appeared gratified. Oh, perhaps you'd like to turn to your neighbour and spend a few minutes exchanging histories. As some of you, I'm sure, will be able to recount your ancestry back two or three generations. Certainly to your grandparents and even to your great-grandparents. As some of you may even be able to trace your family tree back even further. I myself, of course, have been at it for quite some time and have traced my family back as far as Aubrey Delavere Hutchinson of Romford in the 13th century. We all stretch back through our roots to connect with history, you know. Jeez, those guys are boring bastards. Jaime appeared out of nowhere and sat down heavily next to Stanley. Brooklyn, Brooklyn, who the hell wants to live in Brooklyn? He looked turned on, agitated, like his brain had just arrived. Next time we see those guys, remind me to avoid them. Brooklyn. She's just been on about family trees, Stanley said, gesturing. Quite interesting, but a bit lame. Jaime turned to peer at Dr. Hutchinson. I didn't know this. Which leg? What about you? Stanley asked. You got much ancestral history? Me? Jaime settled his mind into focus. Years of it. I'm 76 years old. What would you like I should tell you? Whatever you feel like. Jaime looked dubious. You're interested? I'm always interested in new things. And are we connecting ourselves back to history? Dr. Hutchinson swung by, swooping her head past their faces and was gone. <laughs>